Hi, welcome to No Water River. I'm Renee and I'm pleased to welcome you to the third Poetapalooza, this time for the Poetry Friday Anthology for Science by Sylvia Vardell and Janet Wong. I'm delighted to be featuring Bobby Katz, the author of over 85 books for young readers and children, with her poem, Considering Copernicus. I'm Bobby Katz. I wish I had a chance to learn more science when I was younger. I'm fascinated by the cosmos and the people who revealed its nature to us. One of them was a Polish astronomer called Nicholas Copernicus, and I've written a poem about him. Considering Copernicus. Copernicus, a sage of old, did not accept what he was told. He said, Earth moves around the sun which seemed absurd to everyone who saw just how such things were done. The earth is circled by the sun. Astronomers and other folk thought Nicholas was, at best, a joke. Sun rises in the east by dawn, plows through the sky, and then is gone beyond horizons in the west. Then night arrives and people rest. The sun keeps going while we're sleeping, rising when the birds start peeping. The process was so obvious to all except Copernicus. Sometimes it takes a lot of bravery to say things that other people don't agree with. And we are very grateful to scientists like Copernicus who did that and let us see our cosmos in a new way.